Good morning, YouTube family. I hope you're having a great day today. Uh, my granddaughter and I are at Grammy School, and we're going to do a little cooking project today. We're going to be making the empty tomb rolls, and it will signify the empty tomb when they went to check on Jesus and his body was no longer there. So we're going to share this recipe with you all and hopefully you'll try this at home with your kids. It's really easy to do and I think they'll enjoy it. I hope you uh, have a great day and follow us and see how it goes. Look at the camera say, hi YouTube family. Wave at them. Say, I hope you're having a great day. I hope you're having a great day. Okay, the supplies that we need are a tube of crescent rolls. You want to hold it up to the camera and show them? Say crescent rolls. Crescent rolls. Marshmallows. Hold on up and show them. Marshmallows. Some cinnamon sugar. Good. But you can just make mix your cinnamon and sugar together, make your own. And then some melted butter. Tell them, say melted butter. Melted butter. All right. So, we're going to open our crescent rolls up. Grammy, do you want to use pocket To open it. So, we're going to take one crescent roll. Then we're going to take one marshmallow and dip it in our butter. Like that. And then, we take it and we put it in our cinnamon sugar. And we cover it in our cinnamon sugar like that. Then we're going to put it inside of our crescent row. See Amelia? And then we're gonna wrap it like this. It's in there. Do you wanna do one? Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's put the marshmallow in the butter. You wanna put it in there? Put it down in there. Let's do this, get it wet. Now put it in the sugar bowl. Oops, oops. Okay. Now mix the sugar up on the marshmallow with the spoon. Dip it all over it. There you go. Dip it all over it, baby. Like that. Shake it all over it. Right here with your spoon, you can do it. See? Like this. Let Ernie help you. Dip it. See? Like that. Okay. Then we're going to pick our marshmallow up and put it in our crescent roll. And now you're going to roll it up. Start on this end right here. Roll it down. Roll it, roll it down. up. And cover it up like Grammy did hers. You can do it. Good job, baby. Look. Here. Roll it in. And now keep rolling. Roll it over it. Good job. Good job, Amelia. We want to seal all the ends so it don't come out, okay? Because we don't want anyone to steal Jesus' body, do we? No. no. Okay, you want to do another one? Okay. Here, put your marshmallow in the butter. Yeah. Yep. Go ahead and get butter all over it. And then you can put it in your sugar after you get butter all over it. Good job, baby. Now put it in the cinnamon sugar. Whoops. You know, I can do it. Okay, go ahead. Whoops. <laughs> it keeps falling out, don't it? There you go, love. Good job, baby. Now, put that one back in there and now cover it up with sugar. Sprinkle it all over it. Good job, my love. Look what a good job she's doing, everyone. Doing so good. Good job. Okay, you want to pick it up and put it right there, the marshmallow? Pick it up with your fingers and put it right there. You want to use your fingers. Put it right there on the end. Now you want to roll it up? Yeah. Okay, roll, roll it, up. it up. Roll it up. Right here. Yeah. Well, let's, let's put the marshmallow in there. Let's see. Let's roll it up. Now finish rolling it up. Good job. All right, now we want to tuck the ends in, don't we? There it was. Okay, look at that. Want to do some more? Yeah. Okay. 
There you go. You want to put it, put that one in that better. Mm. Get all the better on it. For baby Jesus? Yes, for baby Jesus, Angel. Because when Jesus died, what did he tell them? He said, I'll be back in three days, didn't he? And in three days, Mary Magdalene went to the tomb and Mary, his mom, and they looked for him. And when they rolled the rock away, the big rock, what was there? Nothing, was it? Jesus was gone. Why was Jesus gone? Do you remember? Because he said, I'll be back, didn't he? Okay, let's put it in the sugar. The crescent rolls represent the cloths that Jesus' body were wrapped in. The marshmallows represent Jesus and his purity. The butter represents the oils of embalming. The sugar and the cinnamon represent the spices used to anoint Jesus' body. The oven we place them in represents the tomb that they place Jesus in. The time that the rolls bake represents the three days that Jesus' body was in the tomb. We will now take the rolls and dip them back in the butter and then roll them in the cinnamon and sugar mixture and place them back on the baking sheet before we put them in the oven. We will bake them for approximately 9 to 12 minutes. Okay, this is what our resurrection rolls look like when they come out of the oven. We're going to let them cool and then I'm going to show them to you. Here, let's see if Jesus is inside the, ro inside the tomb. Is that the tomb? So here's the tomb and we're going to open it up and see if Jesus is inside. <gasps> the tomb is empty. He's not there, is he? Why is he not there? Because he came back to life and he walks among us, do This is a simple, fun thing you can do with your kids to explain to them the real reason for Easter. Of course, the Easter baskets and the bunnies and everything's nice, but it's really about Jesus and him being resurrected. You all have a great day and God bless you. Look at the resurrection roll. There's nothing in it. The tomb is empty. See that?